Hey guys, recently I came across a very interesting video and it's about something called the magic bolt. And that's basically a regular screw where you have a nut that if you turn it in one direction it goes one way and another nut that if you turn it in the same direction it's going to go the other way. So that was really interesting and I was really curious to know how it worked. So I reverse engineered it and made my own. So I'm going to explain to you how this works today. So you see you've got one nut that goes in one direction around the screw. So here I'm going this way, so counterclockwise. And then you've got another nut that has to be screwed in clockwise. And then when you turn only the screw, either they move away from each other or they move towards each other. So that's really interesting. So first of all, what I did was I looked at the video more closely and I really understood how the thing worked. And at some point you can see that when he turns the screw, there are some slight ridges on the thread. And so I, I actually tried to, to figure out what it was. And it's actually very simple. It's just a reverse thread that's much smaller and therefore more discreet. So what I did was on SolidWorks, I, um, I created a regular screw with a thread and created the bolt that went onto that screw. And then what I did was create another thread, but much more discreet, so smaller, and in the other direction. So it's actually symmetrical to the first one, but much smaller. And what that does is it creates um, a bunch of ridges inside, uh, well, basically the intersection of two threads, except one is very small. So you're only going to see the big one, but you're not going to see the small one. So after this, I decided to 3D print it so I can show you guys uh, what it looks like from up close. And uh, I printed this using 3D Jake Eco PLA. It's actually a really cool material and I love the colors. You can actually get 10% off using a discount that I got. It's called Greg. 3D-10 uh, on their website and uh, that way everything's 10% cheaper which is already extremely cheap so that's nice. And also this video is filmed with uh, a Raspberry Pi and Octolapse, this time lapse. So now I have the screw and as you can see when you look up closely you see the, the thread but you see these ridges here and when I turn it like that you're gonna see that you have these small ridges on top of the thread, same as I showed you on the other video. So when I use a regular, um, well, counterclockwise nut, basically it's gonna screw in quite easily, just like that. And then I'm gonna use this nut right there, which has the smaller, uh, the smaller fillet, basically. Sorry, not the, not the fillet, the, the thread and it's going to go in that direction and it's very discreet so you can't really understand what's going on unless you look at it from this angle where you see the ridges and so if I turn the screw in one direction this one is going to slide along the big uh, thread and this one is going to slide along the small thread so you're not going to see what's going on but the two nuts are going in opposite directions every time and that's really interesting so I want to show you guys the big version because there is the big version which looks like this, and I l really like this one because you can really see the difference. You have two threads that are symmetrical, and so it, it gives you sort of like symmetrical, well, sort of alternating ridges. And so on one side, you've got this, uh, this uh, nut with a uh, counterclockwise uh, thread, which goes in that direction. And then when I take the other one with another large thread, but oriented differently, then it's going to turn really nicely in the other direction. And so that's how it works. Now I like this, uh, this concept because it really makes it possible to have, you know, some different applications like those, uh, those camming systems um, in climbing, mountain climbing. So what I mean by that is that, for example, here you've got these two halves that turn in opposite directions. So basically if you pull on this side of the screw, it's going to turn it that way and really push on the sides so it could be used as safety equipment for mountain climbing for example where you have to be really stuck be beneath the cracks in the mountain wall so yeah it's it's a nice concept and it's not just uh, a way to impress people with a magic bolt with two nuts that go in different directions so I think that's a, a really interesting engineering concept so thanks for watching my explanation on the magic bolts I hope you liked this video if you did feel free to subscribe because I'm releasing some more stuff like that on a regular basis and I will see you guys in the next video.